So I cup. Hello everyone, my name is Maggie and this is another episode of RC Modify. In this episode, well first of all, I'm gonna show you this. The Evo is now fixed. The last time you saw it, it was broken. I basically taped the insides and put the pieces together. On the outside right there, I put a blue sticker on it just to cover it up. And yeah, it looks just like new now. And let's get into this episode. I got you a mad speed. This is a 110 electric brushed version. Let's open this up and see what's inside. And I gotta tell you something. A lot of people are asking what's the cheapest, what's the best RC drift that a beginner should um, buy or start off with. I would say this is the best choice for you. It's just about $100 plus a little bit of shipping, probably $20, $30, depending on where you are. You can modify it, you can put parts on it. It's very um, universal for the parts and the wheels and stuff you know I don't know about other brands but this brand is cheap and it's easy to play it's pretty good let's uh, open this up I'm upside down how did that happen and this is what you're getting body pose side mirrors other stuff in there uh, some tools instruction and manual of course stickers got that for I have no idea Let's see what's in here. Okay, you got a charger, controller. So that's pretty much it. Controller, charger, and the car. There's manual and stickers and some stuff right there. This is a Nissan GTR R35 Skyline, the new version. Let's see the inside. That's the inside of it. It's pretty basic. You get um, you get the motors, you get the battery, you get the receiver, ESC, uh, ready to drift. It's pretty straightforward. You you get the ditch brakes on four wheels, which is kind of cool uh, feature. And so yeah, I might modify this body uh, sometimes later. In this video, I'm gonna be modifying a Nissan Skyline R34. It looks like a Tom Attack car, just like the um, Drift Star right here, the Nissan 350C. It's got a white body built into it. I bought this um, spoiler separately on eBay. Different type of wings. Got some screws. The windshield wipers. Side mirrors. I'm thinking about taking these exhaust tips and put them on this body. I'm also gonna put the lights on it. Um, RC car flashing light. We got the car, we got the body, the exhaust, the spoiler. And the light. Let's get into the body cutting process. Okay, let's um cut it. Yeah. First, I'm gonna cut these out. This is what I use to cut it. There's a thin layers of plastic. gonna cut on the lines I'm gonna cut below the lines just so that I have extra uh, plastic left I like it more when the, there's more plastic cover the bottom of the car I should um, make the holes for the body first. Put it on, look at it, and drill holes. I'm gonna use the body drill. got these and put the big one right there we got the, this sticking up bend it off and yes I have to cut on the sides
perfectly uh, matched except on the back but uh, that will give me the opportunity to cut it off and make it cooler that is extremely low guys I'm gonna put on these exhausts. I should put it like this. Now I got that tightened in. is done as far as everything in place I'm gonna be taking these off and cut the body that's how I cut it I'm also gonna cut that part right there. And it's cut. Takes a while. We'll cut these two. And this is what I have got so far. I'm gonna be cutting the headlights. I got that cut off I just uh, keep uh, cutting it straight lines and I eventually cut through the plastic I still need to cut the tail lights and the uh, front bumper let's uh, start cutting the front first Now it's gonna be the back. Now this one is gonna be a little bit challenged because it doesn't have like the plastic uh, lines for the holes and um, the paint that is on the body is not accurate. So yeah, it's gonna be tough. So I'm gonna have to draw it out and measure. Okay, that took a while. I got the dimension on there and I'm just gonna do my best and draw it. Let's cut the edges. There we go. Let's use scissors. Light it up. Light it up. Yeah. And then. 
and I'm gonna be painting it. It's gonna be a sewer. I'm gonna paint these stuff with a flat black or matte black. These are just um, regular paint. at it right now it is amazing let's um, cover it up newspaper And now let's put this the spoiler on and the exhaust. Um, I'm gonna put the stickers on and then the light later. Um, I actually have the, our logo as stickers. We use the um, mo.com, moo.com. The problem is these ones are too small. I was kind of shrink it down too small, so it's got like it's got the white part uh, of the sticker. Now I have to cut it off by myself. You guys can just go to our Facebook page, and there'll be a logo with the black background, probably the second um, profile page picture. I'm done with the stickers. As you can see, it's now sick. Yeah. And so yeah, um, now it's gonna be the light, this one. And let's just put it on, just tape it on. This one right here, the longer one goes in there. Channel 4 should be okay. In there. The lights need to be lift up a little bit. I mean, you know, lift up from the body a little bit. I'm gonna use this to put it on first. It's a foam with the glue on one side. I'm gonna put this on first and then put the light on top of it so that the light is lift up from the body. I got the headlights aligned finally it's really really hard guys I don't know why it takes a lot of time for this one I'm just gonna move on and do other ones yep guys that's how it is I just basically stick it on the wall and that's what you get basically just shine it from the side so that I can get all four lighted up I'm just gonna mount it like that so that it's pointing toward the floor I just got a crazy idea to put this um, yellow lights in the exhaust I got them installed do a little bit of cleanup here 
there you go. It's done. Finally. Let's take a look around. Both cars. Side by side. There's one, one last thing that is bothering me right now. There's something wrong with the front, my vision. When I look at it, I found the um, problem. It's the um, top lip right here. It's bothering me. I wanna make that as the hood. It will look um, angrier. If um, I put something to cover the red light, it's gonna be better. It will only be red. And I'm gonna tape it in just like that. I got them taped down. And so this is pretty much everything. And so yeah, I hope you enjoy it and find it helpful. Thank you and have a nice day. Somebody come.